Hey everyone, welcome to Momogi's Attack on Titan Escape from Certain Death video. I'm Rin, and today we are on Connie's route B2F. Yeah, we'll survive B3F with Connie. <laughs> well, it was a very fun experiment. Not experiment, experience. <laughs> Sorry. Experience, experience, yeah. Um, too much about Titan experiments over here. Ah, okay, anyway. Okay, let's go. Oh, we can hear the Titans banging downstairs. Uh, yeah, it's softer now. So it shouldn't come up. Yeah. Yeah. So close, it's like heart stopping. But I think we make a pretty good team surviving till now. <laughs> Well, we should think about the good things instead of the bad things. And we reply, hmm, you may be right. And the second one is, sorry, I was pessimistic. And the third one is, hmm, no matter what, I can't think this way. Um, first or second? Alright! Oh wow! There's another 40! <laughs> wow! We are like... I think we'll get to like 10 hearts like... I was wondering if we'll get to 10 hearts even at V3F. <laughs> Will we get to 10 hearts at V2F? At this rate? <laughs> hmm. Oh! He came so close! Oh. He says it's good to be with us. Hmm. Yeah. He says we made a good team. I think so too. Hmm. Yeah, so we are thanking each other. <laughs> yeah. Partners. Oh. <laughs> And he stretched out his hand and we were like, What's with that hand? I'm not holding any rations. <laughs> no, that's not it. Mm. So for the... A handshake for... To celebrate the creation of a famous combination. <laughs> F famous combination? Yeah. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> Yeah! So he says, if it's us, we can escape! Yeah! Oh? Oh, if we look closely, he's sweating quite a bit. So he probably expends a lot of energy running away from the Titan earlier. Hmm. Yeah, so we say, maybe you should rest? Maybe we should rest? Oh, we said we said we are tired. Okay. Hmm. Ah. Oh, we said we are tired, so let's rest a bit. And Connie says, "Sorry, I didn't notice." Hmm. Oh. <laughs> the topic, the edit was genius. <laughs> let's go for that next. That's what he keeps calling himself, eh? <laughs> Kony asks, what's your hometown like? What did we reply? Hmm. Oh, we just say it's a normal village and nothing strange about it. Hmm. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Oh, there's nothing special about it, it's just a normal village. Hmm. 
Oh. Yeah, we have to escape to get back to our hometown. Do we add another 40? <laughs> no. It is what? 15 this time. <laughs> yeah, partner. Mm, we're checking out all the question marks first, eh? Okay. So, three rooms with exclamation marks. Let's see. No key needed. That's good. Do we have enough topics for break time? One, two, three. Is it only four? Four. Let's see if we can find a fifth one. Just in case. Yeah. Oh, it's suddenly shook, so we got a shock. Mm, yeah, the building is like getting weak eh, at points. Mm, Connie is wondering why did Commander Evan want to search this place, want to investigate this place? And we are like, I don't know. When we get back, let's ask him. <laughs> And Connie says, What? How can you just talk so easily? He's a commander, you know? <laughs> He's well trained in a corporate world. <laughs> like, you know, any grumbles, you know, any complaints, you know, just swallow it. <laughs> And they're like, oh, you have complaints. <laughs> oh, Evan is a topic. <laughs> okay. Little break time. Evan, go. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Commander Evan. So, what kind of experience did he have before he became a commander? No one know what she's thinking. What kind of life do you lead to become like that? <laughs> I wish I could ask him someday. <laughs> I think the most common comment about Evan is no one knows what he's thinking. <laughs> Which is very true, isn't it? <laughs> Genius! Sales request! Hmm, let's see. Hmm. Hmm, people say that it's impossible that I become a soldier, but I've become a scout. I'm a genius indeed! <laughs> yeah! Let's go with Rhina! Connie says that he thinks he is most suited for battle in our batch. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, he was like gifted with a good physique. Yeah? And and what was the second line? Ah, his battle style makes good use of his physique. Uh, but mm. he's quite soft, as in like indecisive. Mm. For for a soldier. But such guys are surprisingly like um steadfast in their core beliefs, something like that. Mm. Mm. 
So, ah, he must have some strong motivation for coming to the scouts. Yeah, Connie is very perceptive in ways. Yeah, <laughs> the animal instinct. <laughs> Oh, 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 I missed the question. Oh, he asked if it's fun to just talk about him. Well, mm, yeah, they all asked that, eh? First is, I want to know more about you. And... Second one is, because I think you're an irreplaceable comrade. <laughs> The third one is like, um, I think you are very natural, real, yeah. Like, um, not someone who is fake and hiding themselves, that sort of idea. Mm, okay, first one. I want to know more about you. <laughs> you wouldn't think we are some kind of stalker, right? He just goes, oh! <laughs> That's Swiftin. Hitting on him? Ah, oh, I see why so immediately we went first one, first one. Mm. <laughs> Need to um move towards her marriage goal, eh? Hmm, <laughs> oh! All of it was 15 except for Genius was 25. Oh, okay. Hey, not bad. I mean, even talking about Evan, he has 15. <laughs> the others, when they talk about like Evan and Levi, is like 5. I mean, the rest of the 104. <laughs> and we got some minus at Levi. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Yeah, so we must be careful, eh? No idea when we'll meet a titan. Okay. Mm. Oh, we are knocking on the box. Seems empty. Sounds empty, yeah. Mm, nothing special about the ceiling. Oh, is there a key? A key? This black key. Hmm. Well, I guess that means we can enter one of the other rooms, maybe, or something. Hmm. Hmm? What is it? He says, "Look at this." Oh, oh there are some keyholes. Hmm. Doesn't look like it's just decoration. Oh, and Connie's like, "It's a big discovery." Should we just try it? Nah, not so easy. Mm. It's not working out, so... Well, I guess we'll have to find information elsewhere and come back here later. Let's see. Why do you skip the room beside it and come to this room, the storeroom? Mm, she says it's to make Connie walk up and down. Okay. <laughs> mm, well, it's the saddest in she. <laughs> oh, they are blades! Mm. Mm. Ah, rusty, but it can be used, right? Yeah! Great! We actually have blades. That's luckier than our whole time with Aaron already. <laughs> Yeah, the game didn't give us any blades with Aaron, eh? Because, yeah, it doesn't need any. We survived in our own way. Oh. Hmm. Did, did, we, did he say we can leave the fighting to him, or? Ah. Hmm? Oh, we are saying sorry that we left the fighting to him. It's our job to solve the puzzle. An important job. 
it's an important and we ask is that so and we say and the second one is it's nothing it's nothing what sorry important nothing big like nothing important Ah, uh, and the third one is rather than that, I would rather um fight. I want to fight. Hmm. <laughs> Which one? I don't want either of them. And they say yes. It's something big. All right. <laughs> Where's that option? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. How about I don't know. The first one. Okay, we'll go with this again. Act modest. It's, it's nothing big. Yeah. Fighting Titans is even more impressive. Mm. <laughs> Tony says, Well, that bo is both important. So, hmm. It can't be compared, eh? Let's not let's not compare. Yeah, fifteen. Mm. I will battle titans and you will solve stuff. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, fighting. All right. Oh, does it mean that he the equipment is all on him? Ah, yeah. Okay, we only found one pair of blades. So Connie has the blades. Ah, okay, okay. Oh, we don't have gear, but his is spoiled gear. So maybe at some point we can repair his gear and replenish the gas. Hmm. That room at B1F. Yeah. Oh, what? Do we sense titans already? Hey. Oh. Oh. Simster is walking right above us. And Connie is like, the ceiling's not going to collapse, right? And we are thinking, if only Mikasa is here. <laughs> and Connie is like, what, am I not enough? <laughs> and we're like, eh, I don't mean that. <laughs> and Connie goes, well, I know what you feel anyway. She's like 10,000 people. <laughs> and I feel the same. 10,000. 10, Mm. And he and Connie is like, yeah, you can't say hundred or thousand. It's not enough. Yeah, mm, yeah, actually, Mikasa is ten thousand. Yes, <laughs> ah, Mikasa is a topic. Levi is a hundred thousand. Yeah. Hmm, do we have enough topics? One, two, three. Only three. What if we get an option for a fourth? Let's go some more. We don't know of refresh topics yet. There could be, but we didn't see them. Oh, it's um, was it sweets? Candy. Oh, it's candy can, but inside isn't candy. Then what is it? Ah, it's reused for stuff. Oh, now he it made him. It reminded him of his sister Sunny, who also does such things. But she got what? This... Oh! Ah! Oh! I was like, what was that word that she was saying? And she was saying that she got slayed. <sighs> and... Yeah, and... Kony is talking about his brother Martin who copy her. And... Yeah. They'll fight for a can they like. And that will make mom angry. Scold them. Uh, um, she say the mom was not slayed. Congrats! Like, mm -hmm. Connie says, "What are you? What are they doing now? I wonder. Don't I don't want him to know. Stay happy for now. Mm. Ah, family." 
Yeah, that's a good topic. It's a sad topic, given what we know now, but yeah. All his siblings, eh? He had a happy family. Oh? No candles there. Probably the rats ate them up. Next place. Eh, nothing. Are we going break time? Should we take hmm, four topics? Break time, okay. Okay. Is there any refresh? Nope, no refresh. Family first, okay. Haven't met them in a while. Yeah, even yeah. Not that the military food sucks, but I miss mom's cooking. <laughs> hey, but I'm not homesick, okay? Oh let's go with Mikasa. Oh, during cadet days, is it I? Kony, is it? Kony saying I tried to prank Aaron. <laughs> and then, without me sensing anything, she was right behind me saying, What are you doing? I cannot forget her eyes that day. Like in that moment. <laughs> I don't want to know either. <laughs> I don't want to face Mikasa. <laughs> in that moment, I can just imagine. <gasps> Fight! Hmm. Yeah, let's try not to be spotted by Titans. Because hmm. we may not get to escape. Oh, fifth one collapsed then. Yeah, didn't think the ground would collapse. We're unlucky. Or maybe we are lucky that we didn't just fall directly into a titan's mouth. Oh, he's really optimistic, eh? True that we could have just dropped into a titan's mouth, but I mean, there are so many what ifs in the world that, like, yeah, it's nice of him to think on the bright side of things. Eh, what happened? I missed that text while I was talking. <laughs> she summarized for me. Ah. He jumped um, to get to the top of the shelf. Hmm. And he did it like very lightly. And he says, it's just dust, nothing here. And next. What are you looking so shocked about? Uh, yeah. So we say, I mean, you just easily, so easily went up so high. Connie goes, Haha, no height is too tall for me. <laughs> Agility is the topic that was added. Mm, cool. <laughs> well, look, he grew even taller, right? He will make a great basketball player. I mean, both with his agility and his height in future. Hmm, okay, let's look around here. Oh no, there are not many things to see. Uh, don't we get refreshed topics already? We only have one topic, is it? Agility. We use the stick to poke into a hole. And... Yeah, in a box. And there's a sound and open and there's a memo. Hmm, okay. Right, down, up, left. Down, right, left, down. Hmm. So if we get four correct markers, the path will open. Mm. 
mm, it should flow from go from up to down and the markers go from up to down and time goes from left to right okay we found a hint so that should be useful for the other room yeah Yeah, it's sounds of yeah, it's like it's like collapsing sand. Yeah. Hmm. Full of barrels and no topic. <laughs> it. <laughs> what? We heard. Yeah, but it's not a Titan. We didn't sense it. Yeah. Why? Why are you suddenly grabbing our arm? And he says, "Sorry." What? Okay, so he says that um, it's not like um, we can tell if it's a uh, Titan's voice or anything, but he has been over relying on our senses, on our sense, eh? The Titan sensing sense. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, we say we don't mind, and he says that's good. He says, even though we can sense titans, it's not that we are experts on titans like Hanji-san. Oh. Yeah, we agree. What we know is probably not much different from what Connie knows. <laughs> and Connie is like, you... Uh, do you remember my results my, during class? <laughs> In class? <laughs> um. At the very least, you scored better than me. So... Knowledge-wise, I'll still depend on you. Well, let's continue looking. And Hanji is a topic, so I guess we are going into break time with two topics. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go start with Hanji. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, he says, I heard Levi calls her at normal. <laughs> Captain Levi, I heard Captain Levi calls her at normal. So now whenever I see her, I almost burst out I almost burst out laughing. Hmm. Yeah. Ah, okay. I almost burst out laughing. I must be careful not to really laugh in her face. <laughs> hmm. Eh? Oh, we talk about agility and he says, Are you just trying to imply that I'm a shorty? <laughs> It's an advantage, you know? It's a type of weapon. I think maybe he's so bo- Oh! It refreshed! Yay! Nice! Just in time! We're short of topics. Phew! Okay, let's see. <laughs> okay, since she is in control, she has chosen Levi. <laughs> okay. Mm. He really holds up the name Humanity's Strongest. Yeah, yeah, when he's on the gear, he's so fast you can't see him with your eyes. Hmm. The way 
he moves and handles the blade. Any soldier would aspire to that. Uh -huh. But... Well, his eyes... <laughs> okay, Connie says, but his eyes, well, if eyes can kill, I think humans, a human will get stopped by that. <laughs> Seeing that makes you not dare to get close to him. <laughs> Maybe one day you'll progress to making titans stop in their tracks too. <laughs> oh, it's Evan, Evan then. Hmm. Oh, do you remember the day we chose um the regiment? Yeah. Hmm. Ah. Uh, yeah. That day, yeah, Commander Evans said that the death rate was about uh, the first ex the first expedition, um, the exped <laughs> the death rate of the first expedition is usually about what one third, mm. about thirty percent. You know that I wanted to join the military police. Well, it's not cool, but I did get scared. Mm. Sil says she really likes how Connie is just up front like that, you know? Okay, continuing with what um, Connie is saying. Connie says, Why did I stay behind that day? Hmm. It's a puzzle to me even now. But hey, if I'm under Commander Evans' command, I think my death wouldn't be meaningless. <laughs> Connie continues, you think so too, right? Ah! Oh, and this conversation continues with how we are both enjoying talking to each other, yeah? <laughs> Why are you shocked? Why do you look surprised? Don't you think the same? Because he's saying that, um, yeah, how talking to us is, um, um, put his... He's happy to know more about us. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, we are happy to know more about you too. <laughs> what, what, what is this <laughs> saying? Co yeah, Connie says, I know how you think about me. You see, like, things like, Connie, you're cool. Oh, you're such a genius. <laughs> I got it, right? I got it, right? <laughs> Um, we chose not to answer because <laughs> he's just talking on his own and we didn't say anything. <laughs> yeah. mm. So gushing again about how cute Connie is and how we can't deny his cuteness. Mm. Yeah. Well, okay, I agree, he's cute. He's very cute, yeah. Hmm. Okay, we can solve this with the memo from earlier. This should lead to like another passageway, right? Not the door to the... Yeah, not the stairs. Okay, so which hole... Ooh. Um, what was that memo again? <laughs> okay. Right, down, up, left. 
So, but is there a right, like upper right or something, that kind of thing? Ah. Mm. So there are only four options. But I think Connie is um good enough to like good enough friends to correct us, will he be? <laughs> but okay, we shouldn't rely on him. <laughs> okay. Ah, don't ask what's wrong with me. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Um So four sets. So is it bottom right? Starting from bottom right? But the marker flows from up to down. Oh, we haven't talked about mo moving the first one, so let's try with bottom right. Yeah. Hmm. And the second one. Second one is upper left. Okay. Eh, eh, eh! He keeps correcting us. <laughs> he does correct us. Yeah. So it's not upper left. What is it? Mm. Yeah. So Connie says, wait, isn't it this one? Yeah, I'm of some use, right? Okay. It's still bottom right, how Yeah, okay, let's let's look at the memo and see how this works. Okay, the question seems to be the positions for all four. And the options are just um what? Bottom right, bottom right? In what sequence? So, the four corners. Eh? But the second one is bottom right as well. That's strange. Um, are we supposed to just read it like um, like together? Like if the like vertically is right down and then down right. From up to down is the marker, and then from left to right is time. Yeah. So the next one is, yeah, up left and down left. Uh, up left and down left. Okay, let's go. All right, yay! Success. We got praised by Connie, even though he helped us with the first hint. So we should say it's thanks to Connie <laughs> because that's true. <laughs> and second one is thanks to the memo. And the third one is our ability is scary. Oh, <laughs> the third one is like totally praising ourselves. Eh? I would have happily chosen the third one if it wasn't that we did get help from Connie earlier. <laughs> So shouldn't we remake him? Okay, then let's go for the third one. <laughs> hey, so chose one. Oh well. And so is you know the oh and Connie asked um hey me what did I do? <laughs> well, you s gave us a clue. <laughs> It went up by 40 again! Wow! We are really like just cruising along. So says we are meant to be together with Connie. <laughs> because the game designs it to give us 40 for <laughs> every few interactions. Mm. Well, let's continue. Searching for the stairs, yeah. Said that that wasn't stairs. <gasps> oh! The building's shaking! Ah, good luck! DYA. Yeah, I understand the feeling. Yay! Mm, agree. The starting sometimes like the point of when to start. Otherwise you're like totally just pressing keys before it starts and it's like eh? Mm. 
Okay. You did well. Up by 15. Okay. Hmm. Connie is impressed. Yay. At our movement. Okay. We have three rows of question marks. And she chose the middle one. Uh, three rooms of question marks. And she chose the middle one. Mm. Mm. I think we have enough topics for break time. Let's go! We have all the repeat ones after all. Refresh ones, refresh ones, yeah. Hmm, let's see. There was... Me chose Sil. <laughs> Pony says, you can do things that only you can do. And still is cheering that we got praised by Kony. Mm. Mm, Kony says, unlike me, you're good in class. Mm. I'm happy to have you as a partner. Yeah. There was, was there family? Oh, Sasha. That's fine too. Is there Sasha? Oh! <laughs> the partner, his usual partner is Sasha, eh? who's also not good in class. <laughs> okay. Ah, Connie says, if I think about my family, it's better if I just join the military police. If I join the military police, my mom would be happy. And. And I can show off to the other guys in the village too. But I joined the scouts. Well, I chose this of my own will. No regrets. I just feel a bit bad towards my family. Like, like if I die, my family probably wouldn't even know how I died. <sighs> well, so and he continues. So I must not die. I must achieve great things and return in glory. Oh, Connie. Mm, let's see, Sasha, Sasha. Oh, I often partner with her during hand-to-hand -hand combat training. And we always try new moves. <laughs> but Shadis will scold us. Are you playing around? <laughs> Connie says, but we're being serious. And I'll get like um punished, like um corporal punishment <laughs> by Shadis. Off easier than Sasha because Shadis knows that the best way to punish her is to not give her meals. <laughs> her face when she couldn't have dinner that day. It was full of despair. <laughs> ah. Comrades, it still chose us. Huh? Oh, so chooses the drawbridge effect now. Oh, okay. Hmm. 
Let's take a quick glance at the rest. Uh, hmm. Okay. Yeah, let's go for a drawbridge effect. Actually, I want to do everything with Connie. Like, it's, it's so fun to talk to. <laughs> oh! Okay, so... He, so he, Connie saying, Have I ever felt the drawbridge effect with Sasha? Well... I did always get scolded and punished with her. But no, I don't feel anything like that. Well, think about it, it's that Sasha, you know? <laughs> yeah, I think if you compare to that, our current situation is more like that drawbridge. Well, uh, let's just focus on escaping. <laughs> well, when when we're being scolded, I also keep thinking how to escape his scolding. <laughs> well, uh, and still in the background was going yes when Connie said that it will be it's more like the drawbridge effect now. <laughs> Lots of books, yeah. Mm, yeah, Connie's completely not interested. Like, <laughs> it's just books. We don't even see what kind of books they are. Eh? Yeah, with Amin, we'll be like, he will be reading and we have to drag him away, kinda. Oh, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, we already saw that. Yeah, we're dragging him away. Oh, this is about Amin, right? Yeah, Amin is a topic. Let's go and do that next time. Finally. Mm, oh, edible plants. And see, Sasha will be happy to see this. Mm. Oh, what, what? Did he say that drawing looks like it has... Ah, we we're wondering if the the painting also has a trapdoor. Well, let's check it out. We feel wing. Ah, this one, this one. Hmm. Hmm, wait a bit. Uh, well, can't seem to open it, so let's go look at other rooms first. Okay, this one. This is the castle owner's room, right? Hmm. Ah, some grand furniture. Hmm. Yeah, break time! Yay! Let's go with Amin! Tony says, well, honestly, Amin is a little unreliable as a soldier. But, well... Hmm. That's all the more impressive that a guy like him chose to join the scouts. And he's super good in class. Shocking even Shadis. And it's thanks to him that we survived the Tross battle. Okay. Let's see, what else is there? Um joining the reason for joining? Uh 
this is it's embarrassing, so don't tell anyone else, alright? Oh, he says, well, actually, the reason I joined, um, the, the first trigger was Aaron. Ah, but I deliberated, hesitated after the, during the cross battle. And... In the end, it was Jan who ended up giving me a push in the back. After the trust battle, even while trembling, he said he would join the scouts. Well, he was the guy who was so determined to join the military police. Mm. So, seeing him like that, I... Yeah, he trailed off at that point. And then, let's see... Mm. Oh, he's, he says... Well, if I really want to hold my head high when I return to my hometown, I have to join the scouts. Hmm. Hmm. Actually, in a sense, yeah. In a sense, because like, I mean, even though military police is some kind of like, oh, glory, top 10 and stuff, but it's like, it's really, well, people who are in within the walls and not like the scouts being out of the walls and... Advancing for humanity. That sort of thing. Hmm, what else? Let's see. Hanji? Did we talk about Hanji? Or is that refreshed? Hmm, Hanji. Oh, when the experimenty titans were killed. Even cadets like us had to be investigated. At, uh, at the time I thought... Why is the culprit treated like a criminal is killing titans? Plus, I didn't understand why she wanted to study them so much. Mm, but now I think I sort of get it. Mm. Yeah, like the weakness, like the weakness of Titans being the nape is the result of someone's study, right? Mm. Such things are important. So I'm sure her research will become useful. Mm. Oh, torture equipment. Yeah, he's like ill. Hmm. Oh, it's a book that will teach you how to make someone spill their secrets. Like, Connie is like, would you encounter something so scary just for holding a secret? Mm, and we say, well, some people torture just out of interest, etc. In interest? What kind of horrible taste is that? Please don't start having such interests. And you say, we don't! 
<laughs> okay, and interests, yeah, hobbies, interests were added as a topic. Oh, the pipes, the pipes. Mm. Eh, we didn't say anything. Oh, that's all. <laughs> I mean, in the past two routes, like, you know. <laughs> that's all. I mean, like, you know, there was a cut in of Kony saying the pipes, and that's all. <laughs> okay. Yeah, because of the, Im the importance in the past two routes, we were like, hmm, I was waiting for something to happen. But no. Mm. Oh, Kony's are just resting on all oh, that puff of dust. <laughs> he lay down and dust flew up. He lay down without any hesitation. Aaron and Levi will be hopping, you know. No, Errol will be shifting very uncomfortably, like all, all anxious. And anyway, yeah, Levi will kick him, yeah. Yeah, yeah, getting all this dust flying. And all Connie says is, mm, you'll only feel at home in your own bed. <laughs> Doesn't he notice all the dust? I guess he doesn't. <laughs> and we are like, all the dust on your back, shouldn't we get it off first? <laughs> and Kony is like, what? I can't reach, get it off for me. <laughs> and we are like, alright, alright. <laughs> and then pet pet. <laughs> Oh, next one is rest. Okay, let's do, do both hobbies and rest the next break time. Mm. Oh, there's a mirror. Mm. Oh, Kony says, I'm checking my hairstyle. And we are like, hairstyle? Eh? <laughs> what hairstyle? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, Connie says it's short, but it's very difficult to maintain, okay? <laughs> like, mm, it grew quite a bit, I must shave again. Huh, I actually never really thought about how how hard it is to maintain shave heads, eh? Like, I mean, even though it's just shaving, but then I guess you have to shave regularly? I, I don't know. Mm. Oh, what, what is it about what? Colour or face or something? Ah, face. Face seems darker. Black. Oh, can't really see the face. Okay. Because the face seems darkened. Mm. Mm. Ah, the topic is about the castle. Mm. Yeah. Mysterious. Yep, there's a portrait there. Ah, golden frame. Is that that what is that what he noticed? Ah, oh, okay, okay. Ah, it's um what Connie said is it seems like a painting that costs a lot of money. The frame, etc. Hmm, okay. Okay, let's go. Next break time. <laughs> Oh, we need a key to advance here. Alright then. Yeah, it's locked, so I guess we go to the weapon room. Kony already has a blade, we don't need weapons. Kinda. <laughs> I got scolded by she. She says, why can't you be equipped, you lousy thing? I, uh, I, I'm in charge of solving puzzles, aren't I? <laughs> Connie is in charge of fighting. Mm. Oh, Connie says it's dangerous for you to be unequipped. Uh, uh, my friends are just scolding me for having less common sense than Connie. Anyway, break time. Yeah, let's go with hobbies. Yeah. Mm, hobbies. Hmm. Haven't thought about hobbies ever since becoming a cadet. Ah. 
every day training, training, sleep, wake up, training. <laughs> and then classes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, your body goes through training, your brain has to suffer class, and then you just sleep at night. <laughs> Maybe I had hobbies when I was a child, now I don't know. Oh, <sighs> I mean, actually they are still very young and they have to grow up so fast because of uh, circumstances. Whoa. Yeah. Hmm, okay, we chose rest. Hmm. Well, for resting, don't have to do anything special, just spend time as usual. Like going out into town or chatting with friends. So next time you should come along too. Okay, sure. Hairstyle, hairstyle. Okay. <laughs> Connie asked, Oh, have you finally noticed the charm of my hairstyle? <laughs> yeah. It dries so quickly after washing. This is the hairstyle for soldiers. Yeah, it looks fun, but it's surprisingly hard to maintain. Once, once it grows out, you have to shave it at once. So maybe that's why I, it hasn't spread even though I've been recommending it. <laughs> I can't imagine the rest. Okay, I mean, yeah. Well, good that they have freedom of hairstyles. Hmm, let's see. Oh, did we talk about dedicate your hearts yet? Hmm. Oh, yeah, it was refreshed once. Huh? Then how about genius then? Genius. Oh yeah, 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 the dedicate your heart one was the one him putting, was the one where he talked about putting in the wrong hand, yeah. So, hmm? do we just went through genius? It's refreshed. Mm. Okay, genius, genius. Let's go, with genius. Genius, you know, this term is used for people, on people like Mikasa and Levi, Captain Levi. I'm just good at, like, moving my body. And with some luck, I got into the top 10, I know that. And that's why I must work hard. Oh, he's like surprisingly, um, like, sensible, you know, like, like, down, as in like, yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah, I know, I, I know that, but, um, yeah, as in like, because I maybe mean, I'm just too used to him like joking around and fooling around. And yeah, all his bullshitting and like, you know, boasting that he's a genius. And suddenly genius became a serious topic and he's so sensible about it. That's why I was a bit caught by surprise. Hmm. Oh! Is it going to collapse? Oh, somehow we start talking about um, we wouldn't come here to this castle if we joined the military police and he envies Ani. Yeah. And so is this a topic about Ani? I wonder what she's doing now. Ah, 
Connie says she's been sneakily slacking off during training. I wonder if she is doing well in the military police. Hmm, Annie is a topic. Hmm, rifles all lined up, eh? Oh, Titans? We, that's hide! Where? Over here! Connie says. Is he going to grab us and pull us somewhere? Are they gone? Hmm. It's fine now. You. <laughs> yeah, we say good to be small size in such situations. <laughs> and Connie never says yeah and then he goes oh, wait no you may be small size but I'm not okay <laughs> and oh our character says that I'm a bit taller than Connie oh oh height 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 oh let's talk about height next yeah Sil and I are in agreement with about this <laughs> ah ouch are you alright? Oh, we extend our hand. Oh, did Connie extend our hand. Um, oh, he extended his hand so that we can show him our hand, right? Mm. Oh, oh, he's pulling us up. I see, I see. Okay, I see. Oh, Connie is pulling us up. I see. My bad. Ah, uh, ah, uh, and we say it's embarrassing. We tripped over nothing. And Connie says, maybe your feet are tired. Watch your step. Hmm. Yeah, thanks. Oh, Connie says, don't worry about it, but don't show weakness in front such weakness in front of other people. And we ask why? Connie says if it's that woman she's going to say you're uh, Boroku okay yeah she has such a bad tongue she's talking he's talking about Yumiru right yeah ah it's a topic for Yumiru yeah she insults us probably it's alright there's a spear oh we got the spear okay here, yeah, Lancer. Hmm. Oh! He found a key, yeah! Let's go! Maybe we can unlock that lock room next door. Hmm. Okay, the treasury. <laughs> huh? I didn't memorize it, I just saw the, the picture preview. <laughs> When we went by just now, yeah. Oh, he what saw? A, was it a ring or something? Anyway, I ah, he's holding up all the jewelries here. Mm. So he's saying that if I give this to my dad and mom, they'll be happy. Yeah. Mm. If we just have one item from here, we can live comfort comfortably for like one year. Hmm. If I just give away some of this, everyone in the village will be happy. Ah, and yeah, he's so sweet. Hmm. He's thinking about all his like villagers, his hometown, the people in his hometown. And he asks about his um, hometown, Rakago. Oh, Ragako. Ragako. Yeah, Connie says that it's, um, it's just about 30 people in all, so it's like a pretty small place. A, sm a pretty small village. Mm, so everyone in the village are like family. And we say, that's awesome. Mm. Connie says, yeah, I have a brother and a sister, Sunny and Martin. 
Mm, they are very adorable. What? Some something but very adorable. Mm. Precautious. Yeah. Precautious but so cute. <laughs> Mm. Ah. Oh, Connie says, I want to give them an easier life, so I became a cadet. Mm. If I entered the military police, I would get good privileges. And a good position. Uh, well, I entered the scouts. Hmm. Well, to Connie, the biggest treasure is family. Ah. <laughs> well, but we can't take stuff from here. Hmm. Ah. Yeah, we asked why, and he says, even if I give them stuff like my parents' stuff, this stuff, they won't be happy. They'll scold me for sk for stealing stuff. Mm. I didn't join the scouts to become a thief. Mm. And the first one is, I think that's a good call. And second one is... <laughs> then I'll take them all. <laughs> ah. And the third one is, are you sure you won't have just one? <laughs> this is asking us to choose the first one, right? <laughs> it's a good call. <laughs> oh, the second one can be a joke? Okay, go for the second one if you want. Okay, second one. <laughs> and he's like, hey, hey, were you listening to me? Stop it. <laughs> oh, oh I, well, I'm not going to stop you. Oh. Ah, he went down by 15. <laughs> yeah, then we say, uh, it was a joke, of course. And Connie goes, really? Well, alright. <laughs> ah. ah, what is this now? Complaints about me being bad at telling jokes, what? <laughs> Let's go get back our points and get to 10 wings. Yeah, break time. Hmm. Let's see, let's see. Hype. Hmm. Ah, you also making fun of me for being a shorty? Hmm. In the first place, what's wrong with being a shorty? Armin is also not much different from me in height, and Krista is shorter than me. Mm. And even so, all three of us are doing well as soldiers, right? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, why, why doesn't he list yeah, the most important example humanity's strongest soldier being a shorty too? <laughs> Ah, here it is. <laughs> and on top of that, yeah. That Captain Levi <laughs> isn't that much different from me too. Ah. <laughs> Don't tell him that, okay? <laughs> never, never tell him that. <laughs> well, is he very bothered by his height that he worked really, really hard on getting taller and that's why he's so tall in the future? <laughs> he's so tall in the future. Let's go. Oh, still chooses Jan. Mm. Mm. He has a bad tongue and attitude. He's like always getting into arguments and tend to earn people's dislike. He tends to say self-centered things. But I think 
that his call is a good guy. He has taught me tips about using the gear. Let's go with... I saw something nearer to the bottom. What was it that I... My... Oh, how about indecisiveness? There wasn't much about it the last time. Oh yeah, the last time he asked um, what the word meant, right? So this time he says... Yeah, he's learned what the word means. Yeah, he says... I don't think I'm like that. Mm, well, when deciding where to join, I ask for opinions. But, you know, most things I decide on my own in the end. Well, on the battlefield, you can't be indecisive or you won't survive. Hey, okay, let's see. We are max now, woohoo! And only in the middle, well, towards the end of B2F. This is easy. You don't get feel stressed like we were with Mikasa. I was like, will we max her 10, 10 wings before we get to the top? <laughs> let's see. Hmm. Um, training days. Yeah, cadet training days. Oh, see, yeah, Shadis, right? Kiss. Um, is scared. Was scary. Oh, he's still talking about the wrong arm during the um joining ceremony. Yeah, he got scolded so badly. I still dream of his face from then. It was really very scary. At the time, I wanted to join the military police. And I joined here. I didn't know I joined here. Yeah, you, ne you never know what life will give you. Oh, we're at 44%! Can we get down to 30% <laughs> with Connie? <laughs> oh, There's something shining. Let yeah, from the box. So let's investigate carefully. The first option is to reach out your hand, eh? Yeah. What, what do you mean you'll snap? I'm, I'm sure the box isn't alive. <laughs> Wait, bite your hand off. Maybe it's a knife or a blade or something. Okay, slowly we tip the box contents out. Ah, and we pull out a dagger. Yeah, maybe if we reach out quickly, we'd have cut ourselves. Well, can't be used as a weapon, but we can cut some things. Like ropes and stuff. Okay, that looks like all, was it? Oh, we used that. Ah, we used the, the dagger to cut a rope that was... Holding a chest together. Hmm. Nice. Oh. Now the dagger spoiled. Oh well. It had its use. And so we opened the chest. And we found a memo. Yeah. Oh, and medals. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> That's algebra. Okay, yes. Black plus white is red. And green plus orange is red. Blue plus blue is red. Yeah, no, no, no. White plus orange is green. Oh, it's blue. White plus orange is blue. And cyan mm -hmm. um, plus orange is white. 
So, <laughs> yeah, we'll solve it later. All right, let's go back to the room with the medals. Oh, we heard a sound from the room next door. Is it the pipes? Eh? Human voice, yeah! Let's go. Let's go next door to check it out. Yeah. <laughs> Treated your feelings. <laughs> ah. Thought we were going to that room, but no, it's the pipes after all. Oh, who can we talk to this time? Let's try calling out. And he says, um, this is Connie. Do you hear me? Can you hear me? I heard some voice. Oh, that's Mikasa's voice. Oh, Mikasa? Hey, it's me, Connie. Mikasa is like, Connie? Oh, Connie! You're alive? Uh, yes, yeah, John! Did they think we're dead? <laughs> and, and somebody else still says, Oi, John? Uh, um, who was the one? Another question mark? Ah, that's still John, okay. Who says, um, Can you hear? I'm John. Mm. Where are you? Are you alone? And, and we say, John, you're dead too. That's good. You and Mikasa are fine. Well, I mean, the two of them should be fine. <laughs> they shouldn't have any problem. Yeah. Connie says, it's me and Rin. Oh yeah, John will be so happy, eh? I mean, it's just him and Mikasa. So he, yeah, he'll be very happy. <laughs> uh, even though all she, talk, all she talks about will be Aaron, though. <laughs> Yeah, she'll probably be like, mm, I must find Aaron, I must find Aaron. <laughs> uh, anyway, Connie tells him that um, we are somewhere in B2F and... Oh, okay. So actually, they are above ground. We're asking, Connie asks where they are too. So Jan says they are above ground. And... There are titans around too. Ah... Uh... Commander and others are fighting on the rooftop. Uh, there's a few 10 meter ones. It's a tough battle. Why is Mikasa with Jan? <laughs> yeah, Diva is in the middle of the tough battle, getting taking down like 5 to 10 10 meter ones. <laughs> uh, I mean, like, you know, that's where he should be, right? Probably. <laughs> uh, because she asked, Where's Levi? <laughs> <laughs> oh, then it shouldn't be a tough battle. Yeah, it's tough for everybody else. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Connie says, Well, Mikasa Jan, if you're done there, can you come down? <laughs> Mikasa. Yeah. Uh, Mikasa says, Underground? And Connie says, yeah, we both can't use gear. I know it's tough on your side too, but if it's possible... And Jan says, wait, if that's broken now, and well, we hear a lot of clanging, so... And Connie is like, Oi, what happened? Oh, seems like we got disconnected. Like, something happened to their, the pipes on their side, right? Oh. And we are like, Did they get attacked by Titans? Mm. Connie says, Don't know, I hope they are fine. Yeah. We can only trust in them. Yeah, they should be fine. We can only believe in them. Mm. Yeah. So, yes, we must get out and... Meet our comrades fighting upstairs. <gasps> we sense titans. Ah, <gasps> this feeling. Mm. Let's hurry and get out of here. It's approaching. From where? Ah, oh. hey. It's coming closer. I can hear it. Careful. <gasps> 
ni go. Hey, what to do? Uh, Connie, become big. We become big. Eh, we didn't choose. We didn't press. Ah. Oh no. Ah, game over. Okay, the game over. Ah, we didn't press. Okay. Oh. Now it's a challenge. Okay. Hmm. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! We have to go through all that again. Oh no! That was where we didn't save. Ah! We didn't save. Oh no! That was our last save. Oh no! That's like ah. Okay. Oh well. Okay, we sped through and are back. <laughs> and somehow we unlocked the fifth dialogue this time, so... Um, what did we choose? Aaron, okay. okay. Oh, do you remember the gear training during Cadet? Mm. Aaron sucked at it. But yeah, in the end, he succeeded. At the time, nobody knew his gear was spoiled all along. Like, wow, it's impressive, huh? Doing that, um, yeah, his hard work. Like, his, or shall we say, persistence. That's respectable. It's not like Mikasa's overpowering strength or Armin's genius. Having neither of those, he still graduated with that kind of results. Mm. Must be due to his persistence. Yeah. Hmm, okay. 41%, yeah. So now we are back at the pipes, speeding through again. Okay, um, so which one did Sil want to choose? Okay. Okay, so we should save first, yeah? <laughs> okay, so we'll choose um, hiding. Okay. Oh, there's not enough time. We are not going to make it. Let's fight, Connie! Mm. I'll use the spear to lure it. And then... Pony, you take the time to cut the net. He says, okay, leave it to me. Okay, so let's go! So we are bait after all. Yay, nice! Oh, here it comes. It's scary when it's... <laughs> we, we, oh, okay, we got eaten by this one in an alternate timeline, yes. Yeah. We can't run, we are the bait. We can only put our faith in Connie. Spear broke. Now, Connie. And he says, Oh, count on me. Leave it to me. Uh, he did it. Oh, 
Honey to say she did it. Yeah, with those rusty blades, I got down that titan. And we are like, yeah, you're great, Connie. And Connie is like, I'm a genius. This is just work out before bre work out before breakfast. <laughs> Not just me. You're amazing too. You lure it so close. Yeah, he says we are the we are a great combi. Oh. But now, but now both our blades are broken. We must hurry and get to that weapon room in B1F. <laughs> yeah. And Connie's like, never mind, smile, we defeated it. Oh. Oh, we noticed that Connie's hands are shaking. Could it be that Connie is also scared? Mm, Connie is like, well. Mm. Ah, he changed. Yeah, he changed the topic and it seems like he's hiding his hands that were shaking to not worry us. Mm. I always thought I was the only one who was scared and he's fine, but I guess not the, that's not the case. That's what we are thinking. Mm. He's always been acting cheerful to encourage us. I've been too caught up in facing our danger that I didn't think about his feelings. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he he really is like cheerful, eh? Mm. Mm. Yeah, he's doing it like out of thoughtfulness. Oh. Yeah, he really is sweet. says he's relieved that Mikasa and Jan are both fine. Mm, can believe in them. So yeah, let's go open that final door. Yeah, color algebra. <laughs> he's concerned, so can you open it? Hmm. So the first one is we think I want to become partners on equal standing and second one is Connie give me your hand hmm? why Yeah Connie just said can we open it mm. is it something is he holding the medals or do you want to pass it to him or what? don't know Mm. Uh, so the third one is thinking that we uh, we understand we understand that ah okay 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 so okay um the the question is um that we are supposed to reply we are, we are supposed to respond to is that we cannot make him worried mm. yeah we don't want to worry him. So, so the first one is saying that we are, yeah, we don't want to worry him because we want, we are equal, we want to be equals, uh, we want to be partners, so, mm. and partners on equal standing, yeah, so, mm. I vote for one or two. Sil votes for two, so two. So he asks him to give me your hand. And Connie says, eh? Ah. Hey, what's up? Suddenly shaking my hand. 
holding my hand. Sandy holding my hand. Ah, how many times was I saved by this hand? Uh, what, again? And receive courage. Just now he hit his trembling hands to give me courage. What can I give back to these hands? <laughs> mm. So yeah, let's solve this. Mm. <laughs> He's asking, what is the... Huh? Is he not going to question why we suddenly stare at his hand? Uh, well, he asked that at the start and then there was a long silence from us as we were thinking. And he just asked, Hey, Rin, are you okay? And we answer, yeah, okay. Yeah. And then we moved on to, yeah, we're going to solve this somehow. Yeah, so he's fine with us just randomly staring at his hand, it seems. Okay. <laughs> Maybe he decided that he doesn't want to question. <laughs> yeah, all these traps feel like they're toying with us, eh? Like... If you work hard, you can get out. Yeah. And Connie is saying, what a detestable person. He said, sorry, I'm getting in your way to what? Uh, oh, because we are talking instead of solving the puzzle. <laughs> okay, so wait, what? There are numbers? Where are the numbers? What are the na What are the numbers for each color? Oh, I see, I see, okay. Hmm, so the options are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, until 8, okay. So, okay, let's go and see that memo again. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, no, there's no number, but I'm guessing like oh, okay. If this is this shows what? What does the other one show? The colors is it? Not. Okay. Okay, it only shows that there are colors. Okay. Hmm. Okay, eight numbers, right? So there is like probably one number is one color. So blue has to be. Well, okay. Let's see. One three one five two four three three six. Yeah, so red should be six, I think. Let's let's if that's if we think that red is six, for example. If we assume that red is six, then blue has to be three, and then we have white as one, orange as two. So one plus two is three. Not the other way. Oh, it could be the other way too. Mm. Oh, oh! If if it's equal white, then white can't be one or two actually, because otherwise, it would... yeah. So then that means it has to be eight. Then red has to be eight. Four plus four. So if white is okay, so white isn't one, right? So four plus four is eight. Other things that can white is not one or two, also not four. So it has to be three. Mm, why can't it be 5 or something? As in night. Yeah, white. Oh, it has to be 3. Okay, because it has to be like 3 plus 5 or... Oh! Oh, okay, okay. Because it has um to be... Oh, okay. To equal to blue, it has to be under 4. Yes. It has to be smaller than blue. So, white is 3. Orange is 1. 
So if orange is one, cyan is two, okay. So that means white is three, red is eight, so black is five. Orange is one, green is seven. Hmm. Okay, I think we've got it. Wait, did I write it all down? I didn't write anything down. <laughs> <laughs> what? The qu first question is blue. We know that that's four. Okay. And red is eight. And orange was what? <laughs> one? Yeah, orange was one, right? White was three. Okay. And yellow, there's a yellow. Yellow is the one that's not listed. Hmm, okay, I see. So we have to find what was the one that we didn't count. Uh, we got 3 plus 5 and then 6. Yeah, 6 sounds unfamiliar, yeah. Because white was 3 was 1 plus 2 equals equal 3. And then orange is 1 plus 7. Yeah, so 6. Hmm, okay. This will do it. Yay, success! Alright! And it's the stairs to B1F, where maybe gas supply awaits. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, Connie says we did it, and we were like, thanks to your encouragement beside us, yeah. And Connie's like, no, I was just standing there. And he said it was tough for you. First one is, hmm, yeah. And second one is, wasn't tough at all. Third one is, I wonder, wasn't tough at all. Hmm, <laughs> yeah, compared to meeting Titans. Yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely. <laughs> and Connie's like, yeah, don't compare to that. <laughs> Yeah, I don't want to be like the last floor where we were panicking when coming off the puzzle and you're like, yeah, we agree. Ah, we need to focus to solve it and with you by my side, we, um, I felt secure and I could think calmly. So, Connie is like saying that, um, you're making me blush, hehe. <laughs> uh, yeah, I believe in you, so I could, um, entrust it to you. And we go, ahaha! Now I know what you mean. You're making me blush, we say. <laughs> ah! You're so cute. And we finally say, okay, we shouldn't keep staying here. <laughs> yeah, we're just chatting down here. What if they're Titans? But okay, we finally go to B1F. Yay! Yeah, after quite a long time in B2F, we reach this dark room in B1F. And what will happen next? Find out next time, yeah! <laughs> so if you enjoyed our video, like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye!